In this video, I'll show you a very easy method for sewing weld pocket. To make a pocket, you need your garment piece, pocket bag, My pocket bag is uh, 31 cm long and 16 cm wide. The measurements and calculations can be found in the description of this video. And also you will need two pieces of uh, fusible interfacing. First, you need to reinforce the wrong side of the pocket area. This is my wrong side. Apply fusible interfacing to your pocket placement area. When you apply interfacing, Place your pocket back piece onto your garment, right side to right side. Right side to right side, pin in place and transfer pocket placement marks to the pocket back piece. So along the pocket mark lines, just do a straight stitch. When you finish stitching, press out the seam. Now you need to cut through the center of the welt as shown here. Cut into corners, leaving just um, half millimeter uncut. Be careful at corners, don't cut the seam. I'm leaving just half millimeter uncut at corners.
Next, pull pocket piece through to the wrong side. Make sure the triangles at the short ends are also on the wrong side. Before you press the pocket frame, I recommend using your fingers and basting to form the upper fold. Just use your fingers. You can use pins, I prefer pastel. Then press it well. Press it well, carefully forming the pocket opening. Press bottom fold just slightly at this stage. Now we need to reinforce weld area. My pocket is 13 cm long and my interfacing is uh, 13 cm long as well. The interfacing 
should not overlap side seams. When interfacing is fused, check on the right side there is no waves or shrinkage at the weld area. Next, fold pocket back piece forming weld. Make sure that the belt folded edge doesn't overlap the top pocket opening. and press out well. Next, come back to your sewing machine and do a straight stitch along the side seam in this little triangle seam. Do a straight stitch right into the side seam. and repeat the same to the opposite side. Next, do a straight stitch around three sides, starting from the top corner and so on. Do a straight stitch one millimeter from the edge. I like to use sewing needle to transfer threads to the wrong side instead of trimming it off.
next fold pocket back in half and come back to the right side pin pocket top edge in place and do straight stitch one millimeter from the edge the pocket back edges and then knit edges with the serger or a zigzag stitch Press your pocket and you are done! Leave your questions and comments below the video and thank you for watching!